What's up guys, my name's Amy. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to show you how to use the Zoom Handy Recorder to record audio straight onto your Mac. All right, let's get into it. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, thank you so much for joining me. Today I'm going to show you how to use the Zoom Handy Recorder H5 to record audio straight onto your Mac. Of course, you can buy other USB uh, microphones and they plug straight in just the same way. However, if you're planning on plugging in your Rode VideoMic Pro or your Wireless Go uh, by Rode, they actually need a an adapter, uh, and that's a TRS to a TRRS, uh, standing for Tip Ring Ring Sleeve or Tip Ring Sleeve Adapter, and you can get those on Amazon, and I will link that below. Now, today I'm going to show you how to actually uh, set up your Zoom Handy Recorder straight on uh, to record straight onto your Mac. Of course, you can use a condenser mic like the NTG3, which I usually use, and you can plug that in the bottom uh, because this is also a uh, preamp as well, but it works the same way. Normally what I do is I record from my condenser microphone straight onto here on an SD card and then I sync audio. But what I want to show you today is how to use this microphone just alone to improve the audio when you're screen recording or if you wanted to record straight into this and record your uh, audio straight onto Adobe Edition or GarageBand. Okay, so the first thing that you need to do is actually plug it in via the USB and you don't need batteries when you're doing this. Then you need to come over to the side here and turn it on. And what happens is as soon as it turns on, you can see that it gives you the choice of SD card reader or audio interface. What we want to do is pick the audio interface and select. And then it says stereo or multi-track. I'm just going to say stereo for now. It says uh, the choice of using powered or battery. I want to use the powered because I've got no batteries in here. And that's pretty much it. It's all turned on. What you need to do then is head over to your uh, settings in your Mac. So I'm going to do that now. Go to system preferences, go to sound, and then head over to input. You can see that the output, you can actually have uh, this play through this uh, speaker on here as well, but we want to just put the input. Now, because I don't really have any sort of stand for this or I don't have a tripod with me right now, I'm just going to use my headphone uh, holder and I'm just going to pop it on here. And what I'm also going to do is uh, turn, sorry, I'm just going to put this over the top as well. You can also see that I've got the left and right turned on. So once I put that in there, you can see that now it's recording while I'm screen recording. And just so you know, I'm using the Screen Recorder app. You can also use QuickTime uh, and you can also use programs like Adobe Edition and GarageBand. Today I'm going to show you how to use Adobe Edition. So when you're finished setting this up, you need to come into Adobe Edition and just let that set up. Once you're in Adobe Edition, you come over to Adobe Edition up the top, you go to Preferences and then you go to Audio Hardware. You can see here that the input is set to H5 and you might want to change it back to the iMac Pro microphone. I don't want to do that. Uh, you can also have the output. Sometimes I have my headphones on and so I'll have to change the output to my headphones uh, when I'm wearing them, when I'm recording audio. So I'm just going to press OK. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to start a new audio file and you can name it whatever you like and then you can see it here. Then you come down here and you can record straight on. Hello, this is Amy and I'm showing everybody how to use the Zoom Handy Recorder to record audio straight onto your Mac. All right, so that's your track now and you can play it back uh, as soon as you want. So, me and I'm showing everybody how to use the Zoom Handy Recorder to record audio straight onto your Mac. Me and I'm showing. Okay, so there you have it. There's the audio that I've recorded straight onto my Mac and that's pretty much it. Really, really simple. In my next video, I'm going to show you how to edit audio uh, in Adobe Edition and hopefully this really helps you. Alright guys, that's all from me today. I hope you enjoyed this episode where I showed you how to set up the Zoom Handy Recorder to record 
straight onto your Mac. Uh, of course, you can use other microphones that are USB powered to record straight onto your Mac. You can use programs including Adobe Edition and GarageBand and even Screen Recorder or QuickTime to improve your audio when you're screen recording. If you like this episode and you want to check out any of my other videos where I talk about any of the gear and the tech that I use, make sure you head over to my channel and check out all of my other videos. If you're not already subscribed, please subscribe, hit that bell so you know when I post my next episode. And as always, thanks for watching and I'll see you in my next one.